Some things are more important than football. You see, there was an, uh, an article by Peter Schmeichel, one of Denmark's greatest ever servants, a winner of this tournament with his national side back in 92, saying that when Denmark played Belgium, when Paulsen scored, I think it was the second minute, or slightly less than the second minute, it was a message to the fans that it's okay to still want to support your team, to still want to enjoy football, despite what happened to Christian Eriksen. And that's probably what Eriksen would want the fans as well to do, to enjoy the football and not make it about him, to know that the game must continue. So how big a deal is it for them to get through to the round of 16 in second place? Because personally, I think it's an amazing story. It is an amazing story, but I mean, like, all our, it, it, it was very shocking incident that happened to us. It was our first game in, in the Euros, and uh, always we were all hoping that he's 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 doing he's doing all right and he's he's going to recover from the from his uh, cardiac arrest. But when when they carry on the game, we were all delighted that yes, the game's going to go on against Finland. But even even if I start thinking about it afterwards on the next day. I, I was really thinking, like, how can how can they carry on playing the most? And I think they should have slept overnight and maybe carry on playing next day. But I think it was coming from Ericsson that he visits where the tournament's going to carry on and Denmark's going to do well. And listen to me, they definitely deserve to be in the last 16. Now they've got the Wales coming on. It's going to be a massive game for both of the teams. And it's going to be interesting to see who's going to go through with that. Yeah. What do you... Do you have any thoughts about this, Eric, about Denmark and the success they've now achieved at the tournament? I think it's the same uh, same vision as uh, you see here. Uh, I think it was very hard for them first game with the incident. But then coming back from the last position and then uh, qualifying for the next round will give them an, an enormous boost. Uh, and um, I think they will all think about Christian Eriksson, eh, that it was for him but also for the whole country. So it's it's a pity for Jussi and Finland and the Finnish players and all, all the old people, but yeah, they deserve, uh, Denmark deserves to go through uh, because they played very good against Belgium also. And today they, 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 they showed that they are better than Russia.